Hey everybody, today we're going to show you how to complete the quest and unsettling encounter here in Dragon's Dogma 2. So let's jump into it. So this is another one of the main missions that's going to take place up at the palace in the middle of the night. You can see the exact location here on your screen to the entrance. But again, just make sure it's between 12 a.m. and 6 a.m. and you'll be able to knock this one out. Now, once you make your way up to the entrance, you will be uh, greeted by Sonia, who is going to be the one to sneak you into the palace. All you need to do at this point is follow her. She's going to lead you to the right side of the palace through an archway that's going to take you to a side door where we can sneak in. So just follow her all the way up to that side door. Now, once you make it over to the side door, she's going to give you a little bit more dialogue and then you can go in. This is where you have an opportunity to get the disguise if you haven't already. There's going to be a chest right here in this room where you can pick up the armor set that we currently have on that will allow you to freely roam the palace without being uh, attacked or arrested. Um, but once you go in or through the door, you're immediately going to take a right and go all the way down the hallway to this staircase here. We're going to go up the stairs. And as soon as we get to the top of the stairs, we are going to take a left. When we go left here, we're going to go all the way to the end where that door is. And when we get close to it, it's going to trigger another little cutscene. Now, again, this is going to be important. If you do have uh, the uh, disguise on like I do, you can just stand here for the rest of the time and you're not going to have a problem. If you don't have the armor set on, you're not wearing the disguise, you're going to want to hide as soon as this cutscene ends, as these two guys that are speaking are going to come outside. So you can see that I'm just standing here because I have the disguise on that we got out of the chest. They're going to look at me, but they're going to continue to walk by. If you don't have it on, just run behind a corner really quick until they leave. And once they leave, you'll be able to go inside the door. Now, once you go inside, there's going to be a secret door in the back left. You can see right in front of this cabinet. We can go open that up. And inside is going to be the information that we need. We can go ahead and grab this letter. And when we turn around to go back into the other room, this is again going to trigger another little cutscene. We'll sit here. We'll listen to the cutscene for just a second. And once the cutscene ends, we can then leave the palace. There's a couple different ways to get out. You can go out the way you came in, or you can come right over here to this window and jump your way out. Just be careful. It is kind of a long way down. You can land right here on this tent. Now, once you leave the palace, we're just going to head back over to the Star Drop Inn and speak with Brant, who will still be waiting at the table. Once we speak with Brant, we're going to click on the option for the quest that we just did. So when you go speak with him, it's going to be, tell me of the rumors about Allard. And you're going to click on that. You're going to give him the note that we just stole. And, uh, and then you'll get a little bit more dialogue. And at the end of that dialogue, the quest will be complete. But this is how to complete the quest and unsettling encounter here in Dragon's Dogma 2. Hopefully this video helps some of you guys out. I appreciate you watching. We'll see you in the next one.